Oh hey guys, how are you doing? So today I thought I would show you how to record a very old game using OBS. OBS is some really cool software, it's free to use and I pretty much use it for everything. So, first of all, obviously install the old game that you want to set up, make sure that it works and what we're going to do for this particular game is we are going to turn on display capture. Now there's different capture modes and different things that you should use for different games so typically if i'm recording warcraft i'll use for game capture which works fine window capture can be pretty useful sometimes as well but the only thing that captures this particular game is display capture okay the problem is if we were to run the game right now and record it the game would appear in the top left as a very very small box which isn't really what we want so there is a pretty easy way of fixing that. So you're going to want to know what the resolution of the game is. And I can tell you, uh, for most old games, the resolution is going to be like 800 by 600. Um, so what we can do, we can just type in 800 by, uh, if it cooperates, 600. And then we're going to make the top one the same. You can just apply it and then um, let's click OK. These are two different versions of OBS, by the way. So now the screen has got a lot smaller. We're not going to um, change the size of the display capture at all. But the game will record very nicely, 800 by 600. Um, actually, this particular game runs in... 640 by 480 so that's even smaller it's a very old game it's from the early 90s of course the problem is a lot of older games weren't really designed to be minimized so if you do minimize some of these old games they mess up they crash horrible things happen the other thing we're going to want to do is because we can't start the recording um, without minimizing we're going to want to go to hotkeys okay and my start key is control plus close bracket so a whole control press for close bracket and it does its magic okay so i'm going to show you on ordinary obs what the game looks like um and i'm going to start the second recording now ordinarily i would use for shortcut okay let's go to the game which just happens to be the tone rebellion and what you guys are going to see is a very small window in the top left corner this is ordinarily what you would see if you didn't modify anything okay that's done we can quit the game now fan dabby dozy most of the video's done um stop the video recording and we're going to have a little look at the output i think this should be the one putting now ordinarily i would use this happens to be the tone rebellion and what we're we going to see is a very small window. Okay, that's done. We can quit the game. As you can see, we have successfully recorded the game. And that's basically how you do it. And of course, um, I don't think there's much else we really need to go over. I'm going to return to my previous version of um, OBS. You might notice some of the things on the screen kind of black out. This is because resolution's been messed with. Anyway, guys, I hope you found that useful. Um, seeing as how you're here, I actually do something really weird with the audio. So, <laughs> this is the game audio, or the computer audio, I should say. And I've got a ton of compressors here. They're all slightly different. So I can have the um, music up in the game, and all the compressors basically reduce the music when I speak. Um, it's a little bit inelegant, I suppose, but it actually does work. Um, anyway, guys, that's my basic setup. I hope you found that useful. Let me know if you did. Do you have any comments or anything? And, uh, oh, should I play some old games? I'm actually thinking of playing the Tone Rebellion. And I'm also thinking of playing uh, some of the old Moo games. Well, what are they called? Master of Orion, yeah. Um, I mean, I think I did play those a few years back or something anyway what old games should i play and uh have a good day guys bye